Hello, my name is Joel Grimes with the Small Wilder Product Group based in Clayton, North Carolina. We're here today with the all new CAT K Series Small Wheel Loaders, including the 924K, the 930K, as well as the 938K. We're going to share some operator tips with you so that you can get the most out of your new K Series Small Wheel Loader. True throttle lock is brand new to the CAT K Series Small Wheel Loaders. For operations such as long roading or running hydromechanical work tools, we can set that throttle to keep a constant RPM. Let's have a look at how to make that adjustment. Idle on the K-Series small wheel loaders is 800 RPM. Operator tip, you've got to be above 1000 RPM to go ahead and lock in that throttle. You can do a simple push of the throttle lock to lock in the RPM. If you would like to make an adjustment to it, you can do a push and hold for two seconds and it brings up the slider mechanism which you can adjust through the navigation buttons on the secondary display. The throttle is adjustable all the way to a maximum RPM of 1800 revolutions per minute and all the way down to 1000. And this is true throttle lock in the sense of the new electronically controlled high stat drive can be adjusted to a zero ground speed through the left pedal control and RPMs can stay high for good hydraulic horsepower. There's two ways to kick out the throttle lock. The easiest way is to simply push the button on the throttle lock control and let it go back to min RPM. The second way is to actually push and hold on the left pedal control into the panic stop. For one second, it will then kick out that throttle, very similar to a disengage on the throttle lock button. True throttle lock in the K-Series small wheel loader is a nice feature when you're doing long road and carry type runs or even running hydromechanical work tools. The easy to use adjustments allows you to set this machine up to run at its peak efficiency with that application in hand. Now that we've been introduced to the throttle lock feature of the K-Series small wheel loaders, let's put it in application. Here in a simulated truck loading cycle, I'm gonna go ahead and lock the throttle at max RPM, 1800 revolutions per minute. A simple push, We'll lock the throttle. Now I'm going to do some simulated truck loading with my left pedal only control ground speed and leave that max RPM. So as I approach the pile, I'm going to slow my ground speed and then control my wheel slip. Fully load this bucket. Into reverse. Now at the back of the V come to a nice controlled stop and make my directional shift as I make my approach to the truck come to a full stop go ahead and finish my dump cycle a little bit of wrap out and get reset for the next pass on back into the pile control my ground speed and my wheel slip with my left pedal control to fully load this bucket Fully loaded, I'm going to get into reverse and back out of the pile. At the back of the V, I'll do my directional shift, make my approach to the truck, come to a nice smooth stop, and go ahead and dump that material in. Wrap out the sticky material, and go ahead and reset for the next pass. So make my approach to the pile, I'm going to control my ground speed and my wheel slip with my left pedal control only. I'm going to fully load this bucket and into reverse and back out. So I enter my V pattern turn, use my left pedal to control the smoothness, and use my left pedal to control my approach to the truck. Come to a full stop. And go ahead and wrap out that material. Now notice that I can do this without kicking throttle lock out. The electronically controlled high stat drivetrain allows that independent control of ground speed and engine RPM. So I don't kick my throttle lock out and I can bring my machine to a true full stop. As you can see, the true throttle lock in the CAT K series small wheelers working in conjunction with the left pedal ground speed and wheel slip control is going to keep you running smooth and efficiently all day long.
As you can see, the all-new CAT K-Series small wheelers have been designed for operators. We hope that you find these operator tips useful and help you get the most out of your K-Series small wheel loader. Looking forward to seeing one on your job site. Now let's go to work.